Okay, you guys. Early the next morning. Hey guys, what's up? It's Granny Dina. Welcome back to my channel. Oh my god, I am literally so freaking sleepy. It is like 4 30 in the morning. And I'm gonna hurry up because my parents are about to scream at me. But we're headed to Houston. Oh my god. We are headed, please ignore the back. Um, we are headed to Houston. Oh my god, my skin is so good. But um, I'm so freaking sleepy, that's why my eye bags look so bad. But yeah, that's where we are headed. And I need to hurry up before my parents start screaming at me. We are being much, much later. God, this is my truck right now. I'm taking pictures, but I will give you all like an in depth um, video. I mean, little clips of like the inside and everything. But oh my god, I can't believe she's mine! She's literally so beautiful. I can't even believe she's mine. I want to cry right now, guys. <laughs> Look at her, black rims, blacked out everything. Uh, I'll show you all the inside right now. Okay, you guys, so, oh my God, I literally, I literally wanna cry right now. My voice is like, I feel it. I have like a knot in my throat, but first of all, okay, hat. <laughs> Shout out to, his name is Dream Car Connect on, Instagram and he works at the Land Rover Range Rover in um, I mean Land Rover in Houston North He was literally the best he made buying this car like such a breeze and Yeah, shout out to him. He gave me this he gave me the little um, it's like a little cup um, For coffee and drinks to put in here. It's like matching silver with the car. I'll show you all a video of it but Oh my god, I literally, I'm like so speechless right now that I came into the garage and like I opened the door, I was literally like pinch me, like I still can't believe that she's mine. <laughs> this has literally been a dream of mine since like I can remember. I've always seen Range Rovers like and I'm like one of these days it's going to be mine and I never thought I would purchase one this soon. I'm only 21 years old, so that just makes it that much more special to me that I was able to purchase my dream car at only 21. It came with a lot of hard work and dedication. Um, I manifested this moment for so long, so for it to be here is just... I'm speechless. Like, I just can't believe it, and I'm so blessed that I was put into this position to be able to realize all my dreams and slowly but surely one thing after the other after the other I've been accomplishing all of my goals which is something that I am so proud of and I just can't thank God enough for blessing me and my family endlessly and this is just another one of those blessings and yeah oh my god i literally i'm just so honestly i can't even explain how i feel right now like i said this has been my dream truck i got it exactly how i wanted it um the color i got it blacked out like i wanted black rims black detailing everything honestly this truck is like so high tech i'm still like learning so many things i have an app on my phone also that like turns on the truck and like everything i could see it from like miles away i could see um like so many details about it that is just i'm still learning but yeah most of all i just wanted to take the time to sit in here and talk to you all to let you all know that anything is possible if you work hard and this is an example of it and i hope this serves as motivation for you all to go out there and do whatever you have to do to accomplish whatever it is that you want um, whether that's getting a house whether that's buying a car whether that's graduating whether that's getting that 
job that you've been wanting whatever it is if you go out there and you work hard you will achieve it i promise you and yeah i just want this to motivate you all to go out there and do what you have to do to get to where you want to be or to get what you want so yeah enough rambling i'm gonna show you all all the little details in here so yeah let's get into it okay guys so this is my truck i got it silver exactly how i wanted and all the details are in black so some other trucks have silver on this part and uh, this part and the rims and every oh also here in the front um other trucks have it like silver but i got everything blacked out literally any every detail that it has i got it black and that's exactly how i wanted it and um in this like silver color which is my favorite i got the black top as well some trucks have um it would have like this silver on the top but i got the black top because Honestly, I just love the way it looks like all blacked out. So this is the exterior of the truck. So yeah, this is the front. These are the rims. They're so nice. And the, the middle says Land Rover. And then I got the R Dynamic, which is, um, in my understanding, it's like the faster one. And it has, um, it's like the sports version of the Range Rover. So there's like the normal version and then there's the R Dynamic. So I got the R Dynamic package and the R Dynamic also has everything blacked out. So that's where I got like um, the detailing um black and then it's also eight cylinders so if you want to race me <laughs> you might not want to i'm kidding okay so let's start with let me show you this detailing right here it says range rover honestly i'm so 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 obsessed in the front one of the things that i love the most about this truck is the door handle so as you can tell door handles like if it's just like that which means the truck is locked so when I want the door handles to come out I have to have the key next to me or uh, manually open it but like here I just have the key next to me and I could just go like this and the door handles come out and the the mirrors come out as well so as you could tell now the door handles are out once I want to lock it and I'm walking away from the car then they just close on their own as well as once I'm driving, the handles won't be out anymore. So as long as the truck is going at least five miles per hour, the what's it called? The door handles will pop right back in. So that's something that I really like uh, for safety and just like I mean, when you're walking away and you forget to lock the car, um, it'll lock. Also, I have an app on my phone. I can check on the app and it'll tell me if the door is locked or. Um, different features that that app has which is really cool so now we go in so this is the interior uh right now you can't see it but when i open up the door i'll show you all a video um i'll show you all a little clip of that feature when it's dark so you all can see so right here it reflects like a picture of the land rover on the floor so that's really cool but i'll show you all Right so now. This is what I was talking about, the little reflection of the Range Rover. So when I open up my door, it um, has that reflection. How cute is that? And then the light is coming out from right there. It's like a little hologram. And then that's a little picture of the Range Rover. How cute. I love it, I love it, I love it. So, uh, as you can tell, I'm very short, so I had to put the seat, um, hold on, let me fix it. I had to put the seat um, really to the front, but it is so spacious. You will just a second. It is very spacious, and that is something that I really like about the truck. So, let me go a little bit back. Okay, so then, can we come up? 
when I just get in before it turns on so when I get in before anything turns on the um, whole screen right here so it doesn't have an actual like the speedometers the whole thing is a screen so let me show you all one of the features that I really liked so I have the key in here and um once as soon as i press it's a push to start so as soon as i press it this these are the gears and it right now as you can tell it's down but when i turn it on it pops up so that's something that was so cool that i was like i didn't even notice it when i was getting it but now that i have it i've been like seeing little details about it that i really like so this is what I see when I sit down. Now it goes to where I was sitting. Uh, mine is one, so I just press one, and then it adjusts me exactly to where I was, which is all the way to the front. <laughs> okay, so this is what I see right here. This whole screen is for the bottom, so I have two, and the bottom is everything in the interior. So it shows me, um, hold on, let me take off my glasses. So the vehicle and then um, this is where I control all the um, air and then the seats as well. These are the seats. So I have both heated and cooled seats. So um, in the summertime, if it's really hot, I can cool them or in the winter, I can obviously heat them or I can have both. If I want the bottom hot and the top cold, I could do that as well. So that's where I control all of this. And then this is the actual climate, so the air, and then this shows the vehicle. So it's like the all-terrain. I can drive it in the snow or when it's like really like in the mountains. It has like the um, all-terrain. I, I believe that's what it is. <laughs> you can drive it literally in anything. Probably you could even drive it in the ocean. <laughs> But yeah, so then up here, I have all my media. Okay, so here I'm connecting through my phone. It's the one that right there that says range. And then my phone is right there. So I'm going to put Nadine's iPhone. And then we'll connect to the music. Let's put some low baby. So then there is the song that's playing right now. I don't want to get copyrighted, but yeah. So that is... Honestly, something that I love. I love the screen here. It's just so like big. It literally takes up like all of this. Also, this pops out and I can control how much I want it to the front or to the back. So it says screen angle right here. And if I want it like more laid down, you see how it's going to the back. Like that flat. Or I can do it all the way to the front. Which is how I usually like to have it because it's just facing me. And then back to the speedometer, we have my map right here. The song that's playing and then the speedometer in the middle, which is really neat. Let me see what else I have. Um, I have cameras, but it's probably going to show my mom in the back. Yeah, <laughs> I have cameras front and back. Um, then here is my um, location, but it says hello Nadine. I'm just covering my where I'm at, but yeah, that's so cool. I love how when I it turns on and it's like hello Nadine, I'm like okay. <laughs> um, so yes, let me see what else I have here. I have my phone um, connected to whoever I need a call, and then I could also make calls from here as well. So this is the little call button, and then right now it's this one. But when someone calls me two little um like a green button pops up right here and a red one pops up right there and that's how i'm able to answer and then something that's really cool right here is you can pick up the volume just by going like this like, hold on so i just go like this and it starts going up that's so cool and then it goes back down I love that. Okay, so let's go over here. Um, the seats, I'm honestly so, so, so obsessed. So this is the black leather and then this material right here is like a suede, like soft material. I love that. And then we have the white stitching, so luxurious. I wanted everything blacked out because I just like the way that looks. It looks very sleek, especially in Range Rovers. I wanted it to look very luxurious and like expensive and rich. So that's why I got that. 
and let's just do another little overview of the front also i customized everything to be pink so little details are in pink that's why you see it like that and we have some other buttons right here and then the gears and then this is the refrigerated part um and heated so if i want it cold or hot whatever is in here it does that so i just press this button that says land rover and it opens up like that and which is something that i like because sometimes you don't want to have up here like exposed so when you don't use it you just close it like that and then we have um i think this is like for coins and then an actual cup holder right here and then we have the center console which is also um refrigerated on the inside if you have a cold drink you can put it in here and it'll stay cold which is honestly i keep saying which is something that i love but honestly i'm like obsessed with the whole truck so there's that <laughs> and then this is the rear view mirror right here and then up here we have all the things that control like the sunroof and then my um what's it called my garage this right here if i press it down and i press that button right there it'll have roadside assistance anywhere that i'm at so if i'm ever stranded or need someone to come pick me up or something i press that down and I press the button that's in there and someone will come for me right away and then the opposite one this red one right here is for emergency so I press that red button and the police ambulances and fire fighters will come and get me so hopefully I never have to use that praying to God that I never have to use that and then up here we have the full sunroof which is one of my favorite parts so let me show you all exactly how it opens so right here there she goes and she's opening all the way up it's the full panoramic sunroof it goes all the way to the back i really can't even begin to show you how big it is it literally takes up the, the whole um the whole truck sorry <laughs> i accidentally hung sorry so yeah, it literally takes up the whole truck. And then this is how it actually opens up. So that's the actual sunroof opening up and letting some sun in. Oh my God, it's so hot outside. Closing that back up. <laughs> but okay, so yeah, that is the sunroof. Goes all the way back. And then let me close that up. So there she's coming back. Okay guys, so let's hop back. This is literally my first time I've ever sat back here. I've never sat back here. I've just drove obviously and been on the passenger seat. Um, but yeah, so this is the back, very spacious. I could literally lay down. And right here has a button to bring the um, seat more to the front or to the back these are the back seat and then right in front of me i have a coat hanger actually which it co it's connected to the front seat and you can um put anything that you like a jacket or whatever so you won't have it thrown around you have this little hanger right here which is something that i thought was so cool um especially for me because i always have like a purse or like a jean jacket um always in my car just for like emergencies so yeah, but right now she's new, so I haven't um, put anything on there yet because I don't want to. I don't want to have like extra stuff in here. And then on the opposite side, which is the um, next to the for the passion passenger side, it has this little like hook right here to hang your purse. So you would put your purse right here, and then it would hang like right here. So that is something really cool that I liked and then obviously you have the charger down here and the same seats like um, black with the suede um, detailing which is like I said something I love then we have the cup holders right here and yeah it's pretty self-explanatory back here honestly it's so big back here it is I didn't really like pay attention to how big it is back here. Yeah. Literally, I can lay down. Okay, so I think that's all for the back, and then we just have here these like little holders to put stuff in. 
Okay, let's head to the back of the truck. This is the back. And something that I just found out and that I really like is that, let's say you have like groceries or your hands are full and you need to put it in the back. Um, and like you're coming with all your stuff, all you have to do is go like this and it opens up so you don't have to be um, like struggling to open it up which is something that I thought was really cool and convenient and okay so the truck comes with this um, little holder which is something that I like because I hate mess I hate having everything all over the place and it just holds um, like this it says tire pressure gauge a bunch of stuff that I'm <laughs> probably not gonna use myself but um, I like how it came. It came in these like little pouches. Oh, it's look interior care car care kit. You what see? the hell? I didn't even know that I had this. And I just got my truck detailed by Ahmed. Shout out to Ahmed. <laughs> oh. oh my God, look. Interior mm. cleaner wipes. Oh my God. Leather conditioner. Carpet spot remover. Oh my god. I literally had no idea. Look, even a little toallita. Stop it. That's so cute. Okay, well, now I know I have this. <laughs> so that's that. And then I have accessory fitting. I don't know what that is. Um, this is for, I think, my front license plate. But I haven't, I don't think I'm going to put it. If you're a cop and you're watching this, you didn't hear me right here they're like some speakers but actually they're called if you know about like sound systems and stuff like that um it's called a subwoofer whatever that is but it makes the like music sound really good whatever so my truck has that and then this right here is what my salesperson at Land Rover Houston North gave me shout out to him his name's Nate if you ever are in search of a Range Rover Land Rover anything he is the person for you he's out in Houston my dream truck was in Houston I didn't find it here in San Antonio and I wanted to make sure that I got something that I really liked and I found it exactly how I wanted over there so that's why I headed that way and he gave me this little bag for my purchase which is so sweet of him um, he gave me this little thermal for my car and honestly I love it because I'm very like I said like an aesthetic type of person and because my truck is gray and this is gray this is probably the only thermal I'll ever have in my car just because I don't like like a bunch of random colors and like everything on and stuff so yeah this is something that I will be using so much of I haven't used it yet because I wanted to record this video first um, but yeah, this is a little thermal that he gave me. Then he gave me this hat that says Range Rover. Okay, fancy. And then, Mama's going to get a little closer. He gave me this right here, which says, Welcome to the family. So nice. And then on the inside, it has two little keychains and a pen that are from Jaguar Land Rover. So nice of him, so thoughtful. And I really like this. It made the whole experience, honestly, 20 times better. So yeah, shout out to him. And I will keep that back here. I'm gonna take it out eventually, but I wanted to put it in here to show you all what he got me. And then, have I showed you all the keys yet? No, I haven't. Okay, so this, these are the keys. Um, it says Range Rover and then it has to open up the back my lights to lock and unlock and then obviously I have my pepper spray and then my little ojo and then my house keys so yeah these are my keys right here also this is the big one so yeah oh uh, then this is the passenger side right here just like before, it has the R Dynamic right here and then Range Rover. Oh, also something else. These lights are touch screen, so all I need to do is go like that. And they turn on. Like that. And then turn it back off. And then if I press it for a long time, it goes on auto. So every time I turn on the truck, all the lights will turn on. And right now, it's kind of hard to tell because there's sunlight, so you can't see the lights turning on. But there's a light down here. 
and then in the night time i'll show you all that as well i'll insert a clip i have ambient lighting so around i could change what color i want the interior i have it like on a pink color right now because you all know me that's probably the only thing pink that i will have in here because it just gives it like that little touch that i love but i'll insert a clip anyway of the ambient lighting so you all can see how it looks inside when it's nighttime okay you guys so this is the ambient lighting that i'm talking about so this is my steering wheel and then we have the light right here and then into the cup holders as well and then in the back of this screen um it also has that pink ambient lighting and it has it over there as well it also has it in the back seats and then here on my settings i could change it to any color but i want it pink of course so yeah that's pretty much it i have to go already so yeah get out of my car and thank you for watching okay guys well that concludes today's video thank you guys so 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 much for watching i hope you all love my truck as much as i do literally it's gonna be like that tiktok that i've been seeing that it's like prepare to be sick of me <laughs> I'm going to be recording so much in here. I just know it because I'm literally so obsessed already. And I've already been taking like millions of pictures and videos. But yeah, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.